Girl, so after this incident blew up and 65 hotels under its chain has been affected from review bombing by netizens who are not happy, um, Intercontinental Kauai has come out with a statement saying that the member of the staff from the resort will be suspended while they continue to investigate the manager's conduct. Now, word is that Pico is not really going to get fired. She is merely going to get transferred to another department. Now, I don't know if it's true or not, but that is the word that's going around. As for Nong Kwai, her job is still safe with the Intercontinental, but she's asking for privacy at this time of morning because ever since the whole incident blew up on SM, um, the media has been, you know, hounding her relentlessly. As for Pico, this is like a compilation of her statuses on FB ever since the event blew up. So she's like, what is happening to me? Did what I do, was it that bad? I'm sorry for what I did is something that's so thoughtless and reckless and I hope that everybody can forgive me. Status right here, when the time is right, she's going to be coming out with her side of the story. Mm. What is so ironic about this Pico character is that she is like the do as I say, not as I do kind of person. Like back in 2015, netizens found on her status that she took leave to go take part in a Mother's Day event for her kids' school. So then people started like bombing in the comment section like, so how come you were able to ask for leave? How come there is an exception for you taking leave for a family matter? This is why I absolutely hate this so-called nine to five job in the office because you have people from all walks of life with their own baggage, with their own trauma, with their own stigma, and you're just coming in together and those with like the power would love to abuse and like project that to their like underlings and play people against each other, you know, just for the sake of like, fulfilling whatever it is that they were lacking in the past. Absolutely hate it. And this is like talking from like a firsthand experience. It's absolute BS. It's just so exhausting because you're there to like do a job. You want to be good at it. You want to work hard, but it's just like these people are